My first year as a Rocket, when I learned the Soldier Fall, I remember it was so hard for me to figure out. We learn it six girls at a time first. Six of us go up and then we add on and we do 12 girls at a time and then we'll add on a little more and we'll do 18 girls, which is half the line. And every time it just feels a little bit different and everything moves a little faster and then eventually we get to doing it with all 36 women at the same time. It starts off by having somebody rock up on their heels and start to go back and you raise your hands up and slide your hands through and open your arms and when that woman in front of you is on your chest, then you do the same thing, you rock up on your heel and everything keeps going up and back. And the other thing is that our feet have to be completely lined up because you don't want the fall to go one way or the other because somebody's knee could get hurt. You want to be giving resistance to the person in front of you so that you help them do the fall. You start working on being active in that fall long before it gets to you so that you really feel it coming and you help the people in front of you. So it is a complete team effort. By the time we get to the stage for the soldier fall, it feels completely different than in the rehearsal room. You know, we're just in our rehearsal clothes doing it, but once you have on the hat and the jackets and the gloves and our pants are nice and stiff so we look like real soldiers, it really puts you into that, that soldier feeling. We have these big hats on that you have to keep straight. And normally when somebody is coming back, your nose is completely smashed and you have to not turn your head, which is exactly what you want to do, but you have to just trust that yes, my nose is going to get flattened a little bit, but it'll be all fine <laughs> once it's over. As soon as the soldier boy brings out the cannon and he, he shoots it and the little flag comes out saying boom, everyone in the audience dies laughing and we want to start laughing as well because it's so cool. It just reminds you how silly it looks to the audience. It really brings so much joy to that part of the show because it can be stressful at times. You want to make sure you're doing all of your steps and doing the fall correctly, but then you remember that it's an iconic part of the show. The audience loves it and it really is their favorite part, which makes it one of my favorite parts in the show to perform.